Hey guys, just at Morrison's in Manchester, hunting down Hot Wheels. Let's go in, let's see what they've got. I'll see you in there. Right guys, here we go. We've got two boxes here, but it looks like, yeah, not really many Hot Wheels in there, if any. So we've got one box to go through. Let's see what we can find. And straight away, the first thing that I can see is the 82 Toyota Supra. So that kind of makes me think that it's going to be the JRK case from uh, 2023. Um, but yeah, non-super treasure hunt. Really good casting though. I do like this one. Very retro from the 80s set as well. So very fitting that it is a retro one. Uh, yeah, very nice in red. What else have we got? Got a mod speeder, which is cool. Got, oh, a nice looking uh, Nissan Maxima drift car. You've got the blue Pontiac Firebird. You get that in white as well, can't you guys? Oh, it's the 87 Ford Sierra Cosworth. I found this the other day in um, the Entertainer, but yeah, really, really awesome classic rally car, this. Definitely a desirable car for me. Great little bit of detail on the side there. In silver though, not my favorite color. Yeah, it's a really good find. Pop it to one side. I definitely need to get a couple of those so I can open one. Um, let's keep going. Oh, it's the treasure hunt. It is the Toyota Land Cruiser. Very, very nice. You can see the stamp on the back, treasure hunt on the card as well, silver treasure hunt. I looked into this one recently and it's actually the truck that Elvis and his friends were driving. I have no clue more than that. I'll pop some stuff on the screen, but yeah, absolutely fantastic retro style livery on there as well with those stripes. Nice detailing on the front end, cool tires, nice big chunky tires. Yeah, great find. Didn't know we'd find a treasure hunt, but yeah, let's hold, let's see if we can hold out for a super now. <laughs> oh, the 83 Chevy Silverado, very nice from the slam set. That's the big version of the Silverado, isn't it? Yeah, because you can get the tuned versions as well, can't you? We have a, oh, a very nice a Mazda 787B, which there is a super treasure hunt version of this that is coming out this year. I absolutely love the shape of these Le Mans style race cars. I think they're very, very nice. Look at that single seater inside is it as well yeah <laughs> that's cool it's got good year on the uh, big spoiler at the back from the retro racers set yeah very nice one this i uh, do have this one already but i'll pop it to one side oh very nice a 2017 audi rs6 avant in that british racing green with so much detail on the front and back of this thing Absolutely love it. What does it say underneath the license plate there? Is it Quattro? Yeah, it is. I think it is. Very nice. HW, RS. Yeah, awesome. I'll uh, pop that to one side as well. Finding some good stuff in this box so far, guys. And I've just spied something that I have been looking for. It's the pink Barbie Corvette from 1956. I have nearly every other version of this, but I don't have the pink version. And I, I really wanted it because obviously it's the like first uh, variant as well. So yeah, very nice. It does say on the license plate there, Barbie. And I think it does have Corvette written on the bonnet too. The badge, uh, not too fond of the wheels on this thing, but still nice little casting. And it's got the Barbie movie stamp on the top left there from the Hot Wheels screen time set. Yeah, definitely got that. Let's pop it to one side. So, let's have a look what else we've got in here. 
a very nice a Porsche 911 GT3 in red with golden wheels. Nice big black stripes on there as well. Nice detailing on the back. It's got 2023 on the license plate. And on the front there, nothing, not much really. I mean, it's got the headlights, it's got the badge. I guess that's enough. Still, that's a nice casting. Let's keep looking. Oh, we've got the BMW 507, which is a super treasure hunt in 2024. Uh, but yeah, just a normal casting of 2023. I like the metal uh, body. I like the metal bottom, that's cool. I like the wheels on this thing. Nice BMW sign on the side there. And on the front, just not really much going on at the back. Still very nice looking casting. Gotta love the factory fresh set. Pop that to one side as well. Oh, we got, we've got loads to look at, guys. <laughs> I don't know what I'm gonna buy. How much are they from here? That's something that I didn't check. How much are they? Not seven pound 40. I hope not. Jesus. Um, oh, two pound 15 here. Uh, all right, okay. I guess that's okay. Not too bad. Could be better though. We're looking at like one pound 50 is like a good price for Hot Wheels right now, like one of the cheaper prices. Um, I'm thinking £2.50 to £3 is like the more expensive side of things. So £2.15 ain't too bad. It's kind of nearly in the middle. Oh, there's that uh, tuned Chevy Silverado. Tuned version of the other one. Where is it now? I'll pop them together. Yeah, <laughs> not a clue. If I see it in a minute, I'll put them together. Um, oh, Dodge Viper RT10 in purple. Oh, that's a very nice purple. Look at that, it also says Viper RT10 there on the side. Very nice. Yeah, I love this one. That looks really, really nice. I'll uh, actually pop that up here too. This whole case has got loads of good stuff in. Oh, it's got the Honda Civic Custom, um, which I found the other day. I really like this one. I wonder what the Japanese says there. Do you think it says Civic or Hot Wheels? I'm guessing it says Hot Wheels. It has done on most of them. Got the headlights on the front, a little bit of, uh, you've got the Honda badge. Nothing on the back though, completely plain. Very cool casting though, I like that one. Oh, the Ford Mustang Mark E 1400. Yeah, it's a cool casting, but I don't like that it's just completely plain on the front. So not very collectible for me, really. I like the, uh, I do like the livery, Ford Performance livery and the blue on it's nice as well. Very nice. We've got a Porsche 911 Carrera RS 2.7. This has got the uh, nice 75 years of Porsche stamped up at the top there. And if you look on the back, we should be able to see, yeah, on the back of that spoiler, you can see a 75th anniversary marking for Porsche. Obviously the 75th year was last year. So this is from last year, but I, I love that orange on this thing. I don't think I've ever seen an orange Porsche driving down the road, guys. Have you ever seen an orange Porsche? Or, the, oh, I think probably one of the only orange cars that I've ever seen is a uh, Lamborghini just driving around, you know? Uh, you don't tend to see a lot of orange stuff. Let me know, guys, if you've seen it or if you own an orange car. <laughs> Let's add that to the pile up here. Let's keep going. Oh, we've got the Zamac version of um, the twin mill with the braille on the front to let people who are blind know exactly what this casting is. You can tell by feeling the uh, name of the casting on the front there. Oh, that could have been a treasure hunt as well, couldn't it? Super. It's uh, the 69 Shelby GT500. Never seen this one as a super, but um, yeah. Really nice open top convertible cast in this. Like that. I wonder why it's got the uh, little bumps on there. Are they supposed to be like um, 
some visors that you can pull down. I don't know. On the side it says hot, hot ones, hot, hot something. I don't know. I don't know what it says, guys. I'm, I'm blind, can't see. <laughs> but that paint works really, really nice. It's a good color. And then wheels too look really good for mainline. Very cool. Yeah. Uh, just pop that down. Shame it's not super though. <laughs> Do like the quick bites i think that this is actually a really good uh, graphic on the side of these things they don't have much else going on for them except for they've got metal base which is nice it gives it a bit of weight uh, but this side at least looks really really good i love the little menu on the mild hot extra hot and fire yeah looks very good cool Oh, the Corvette C7 Z06. This is a nice looking race car on that front end. Yep, really good detail. Love the lights on this. Big silver stripes on that bolt gun metal. Color of paint. Great paint work. Love the metallic shine. That back end's nice too. Actually a really good cast in this. I do, I think I've got it already, but I'll just pop it up here just in case. I'll have to check. Right. That's everything. We've been through that whole case. Uh, I'll put all this stuff back and then we'll have a look at the other case, see if there's anything in there. I'll uh, be one sec. Right, guys, I've tidied that one up. Let's have a quick look at this other box, see if there's anything in there. Oh, we got a sil uh, Tune Silverado. Um, maybe we'll get something. Maybe we will get something. You never know. Okay. Super Mario, obviously. Part of the Hot Wheels uh, gang. Okay. Yeah. I think we'll leave it at that, guys. Let's go and have a look at what we found. We found some awesome castings on this hunt, guys. If you enjoyed the hunt, please like and subscribe, and I'll see you on the next one.